매번 야야야야야 불러 널 야야야야 내 맘을 고백하려고 타이밍만 보는 나 그런 나를 안 보면 왜 그러냐고 묻네 너 때문에 After being done with her dinner, you came to your room and fell asleep in your beautiful dreamland. But your sleep got disturbed when you heard the voice of someone crying. You got up and checked your phone to see the time. You freaked out, thinking of the worst possibility, and hid yourself in the duvet, not having enough courage to get up from your bed. The voice of the sobbing got louder by each passing second. So, keeping your trembling hand on your chest, you collected your lost courage and got up from your bed slowly. You came out of your room in the hallway of John Mansion and moved towards the voice of the sobs. As you were stepping, the voice was getting clearer and louder, making you clench on your night suit. You moved more forward and finally stopped in front of a room, which surprisingly belonged to Junker. You tried to push the door and to your luck it was not even locked the door got pushed and the next scene made you widen your eyes You mumbled when you saw Jungkook sitting on his bed while wrapping his hands around his body sitting at the corner of his bed and sobbing hard while keeping his head on his knees You marched towards him and touched his shoulder only to receive a jerk from him. Well, you knew this was coming. You said softly while trying to get near him but Jungkook looked at your face and moved more backwards. You saw his swollen eyes and how he was covered in sweat completely, making him look like a mess. You poured a glass of water for him and forwarded it towards him while Jungkook was trembling due to some unknown reasons. Isn't he a mafia? Do the mafias cry? Wait, that's not the exact question for now. The question is do they even get scared? Judging by Jungkook's personality, you never had imagined that he will cry, but here he was. Slowly, Jungkook turned towards you. and tried to take the glass from your hand but failed miserably as he was still trembling so you put the glass near his lips and made him drink the water while slowly cupping his face from your free hand you found jacko coming down so you sat at the edge of the bed and looked at him closely while he was trying to suppress his sobs you sadly smiled at him As if he was waiting for you to say that, he broke into tears again and moved towards him to pat his shoulder. What was surprised you most was he wrapped his hand around you and put his head on your shoulder while crying. He hugged you tighter and you caressed his head while patting his back. You then realized how mature you were being right now, not like your usual self, the goofy one.